Hello, lords and ladies, and welcome to Delicatorium. I'm your host, Shade Renard, and today we have Starbucks Peppermint Mocha. Now, I got this around Christmas time. It's a bit after Christmas now, but um, hopefully this might still be on the shelves for you guys to be able to get it. Um, I will try and find a link uh, online so that way you guys can purchase this, but <clears throat> I saw this on the shelf, and I love like peppermint bark, really peppermint anything. Uh, mint things, I just love them. So, uh, in the theme of Christmas... I want to try this for you guys, so let me get into it. If I can open it. There we go. Mmm. Smells like peppermint coffee. That's delightful. By the way, if you guys didn't know, it's almost 3 a.m. right now, so yeah, I'm drinking coffee at 3 in the morning, but hey, whatever. Well, it didn't say I needed to shake it, so. But it is really good. Um, the peppermint's there. It's subtle. It's not as minty as I was expecting it to be. Like, I don't know if you guys have ever had, like, a York peppermint patty, but I was kind of expecting that with coffee. And that's not what I got. I just, it's really nice, smooth like iced coffee with uh, peppermint. Basically it tastes like coffee with peppermint creamer. So it's not overly wowing, but it is nice. So since I do like, even though it was a bit expensive, I think it was like, I want to say it was like 250 a bottle, which is a little expensive for a um, 14 ounce bottle. Yeah, it's a little expensive. So taking the price into consideration, taste, um, and all that. I'm gonna have to give this... Uh, I wanna say a 6 out of 10, because it wasn't overly powering with the flavor. It wasn't something I'd say that's really special. You know, buying once during, like, the, the holiday season? Sure, yeah, you know, that's cool. But, do I see me, like, buying more of these? No, because I'd rather just go and get, like, a peppermint creamer, or a mint creamer, or something that I can just put in my regular coffee. And then I can just brew it myself and have as much as I want. So, yeah. I'm definitely going to give this a 6 out of 10. Um, it is decent, though. I enjoy it. But, like I said, it's just... I'm not overly fascinated with it. Unlike the pumpkin spice one of this, I think I did a video of. Pretty positive. Yeah, me and the Super Saiyan Kid did it. So, um, I actually liked that a lot more than this. So, I don't know. Um, I believe they still have a salted caramel coffee like this out. I saw it on shelves. I didn't pick it up, though. Um, but if I can find that still, maybe I'll give that a try as well and see what that's like. But, uh, yeah. This isn't bad, but it's, it's definitely like peppermint with like a little bit of chocolate in there because you can taste the mocha, but it's like very subtle. So, thank you guys for watching. I'm Shade Renard, and as always, like, comment, and subscribe, and click that bell icon for future videos from me. And we'll see you at the journey's end. Ta ta.